now we have Naders against the Flash. If Naders wins, then, well, that's it for Super Magicals. We'll have Super Magicals versus Reddit Alpha in the finals. If mm -hmm. the Flash beats Naders, it'll be the Flash versus Clark Kent to decide which of these people mm -hmm. move on. Here we go. Let's get into it. Somebody says easy and calculated for Clark. <laughs> calculated. He calculated. He just knew it. He's just counting the math. Just doing the math in his head. Oh, man. Well calculated. Clark Kent, 100% skill. Yeah. <laughs> no, no luck. Yeah. All right. Princess comes down. The Flash has archers. Archers versus princess. No, they can't have archers. He can't have archers because Procol had archers. Oh. <laughs> we got it. It's such a bummer that King Broco! Broco! Clash Wars! Clash Wars! <laughs> no, I can't. I'm not gonna. I can't talk Clash Wars this fall. I think it's close one. Broke. Oh, man. But Wizard's in there. Let's see how this deck Wizard. goes. I might let this one go. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, he's using a lot of different cards. <laughs> but just the archers. Yeah. Why are the archers there? There's only one Musketeer, and Nader's has it. Nader's got the one Musketeer. Uh, uh, Flash versus Superman. Oh, that's really interesting. We got the, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Flash versus Superman. Nice. Oh, because he's got the little the S sign or yeah, the dollar yeah, sign? Yeah. I mean, eventually he'll fight. If Maybe he'll fight Clark Kent. Sure, too. sure. Yeah. Oh, good arrows there against the Mean Horde. Now, that's yeah. definitely... Arrows is one of those cards I think is a really good strategic pick in this format yes. because minions and minion princess, all those things are pretty high picks, and then you might actually be able to get mm -hmm. arrows in there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we'll see. Tombstone, wait, and Flash. Oh, Tombstone's also in Procol's deck. Right? Was the lightning in there yes, too? Yes, because he mirrored Or Flash has ten cards. I think they I think they thought that the subs were shared between The subs, yeah, the subs are not shared. That was the idea, I, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I don't I don't exactly know. Like maybe language. Well, yeah, the, the, they, thing, the thing is, King K knew this form was like, had been really over the rules a whole bunch, and then he couldn't mm -hmm. make it because the internet, whoa, minions! Wizard's showing off some some tough stuff here, though. Fireball. Yeah, Wizard is a fantastic card just because he yeah. eliminates cheapy splashes. The only thing is that he costs a lot. Right. Oh, and there's the Tesla Tower. We were wondering, what would Tesla be good against? And sure enough, there's mm -hmm. a lot of cards in... Nader's his deck that, uh, uh, oh wow, the tombstone and then, and then yeah. pretty good. Oh, that prince's volley was at the yeah. exact right time. And takes out the one archer and the other one gets killed before even, I think, making a, making a hit on the tower. Minion hog rider. Oh, gets both. Oh, gonna walk right by it. Oh, get one. Oh man, Wizard's been really impressing me so far. Wizard was the actual last pick of the draft. The yes. Last 40th card pick. And so far, it seems like the MVP of this matchup. Oh, oh, oh double wizard. What, the mirror, oh, mirror's in there too. God! <laughs> uh, I mean, they, they clearly just don't really understand the rules. Yeah, yeah, totally. We, we, this, and here's the thing, though. This isn't their fault. This isn't yeah. Pro Cole's fault. This isn't Flash's fault. Yeah. The onus is on us, the tournament, and really, Rumham. Rumham wrote these rules. Rum, it, the onus is on Rumham to make the rules very clear. Uh, I think they were a little too complicated, but that's why we do, that's why we do trial yeah. events. That's why yeah. exactly why we do this. Yeah, complications is definitely something that we've had to think about. Ever since the start of the Super Rounds Club, but one of our concerns was that the double deck format that we run now, yes. thank God people have got onto it, but we were very concerned. I was very concerned when I was first designing the Super Rounds Club that people would not be able to understand this, so language was something that was very important yes. to me. But yeah, and, and this is exactly why, because it is very hard. It is difficult. I mean, yeah, you, it's difficult to try to um, uh, communicate very complicated rule formats, you know, especially when people have never really played it before, but that's why we're doing this. Yeah, yeah. Well,. I mean, and at yeah, least we get to see Mirror Wizard, right? <laughs> yeah, hey, buddy, I can see exactly. I'm having fun just watching weird matches. Buddy, we got we got plenty of time left. Let's do yeah. this. Yeah. Thanks, Poison. Misses the Tesla. Could have moved it over one. Yeah. Got everything plus the Tesla. But oh! Oh! Good lightning there. I like that lightning. I think he actually hit something else, too. Yeah. he. Actually, it hit something that was like just summoned almost, like an ice yeah, spirit, maybe. Yeah, there it is. There we go. Got Good it with game. the Mirror Lightning. Uh, yeah. Game probably doesn't count. <laughs> But what do we do? Because I don't actually know if they've been clear about what 10 cards they get to use. What are Flash's 10 cards? Arrows, Wizard, Mirror. But he already said Mirror and Procol used Mirror. Yeah, I, I, the, at this point, I think they have a completely different understanding about how the, how the cards work out. So yeah, we might, we might want to get our admin like to reconnect with both of them and be like... Well, I'm, hey. talk, I'm talking to them in between the games here and it's like... Okay, you can't use 
Any so cards that Pro Cole used. Ten cards belong to Pro Cole. Yeah. Ten cards belong to you. Twenty picks. Ten belong to each player. And, you and there's no, no overlap. Share. There's no overlap. Even even if you think Procol is is lacking and, and is starving and is in in a bad spot, yeah, yeah, you yeah, cannot yeah. give him. You cannot charity him cards. Ten cards belong to you and only you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got huts to move. All right. <laughs> Oh, Naders and okay, this is game two. So what we're gonna do, just for the sake of speed, because we, we got to get to the finals here. Um, yep. Flash is down one zero. Yep. And so Naders up. So Naders has to win this game, or Flash has to win the next. Oh, two. Ice Spear Hog Rider is a sick combo. Very good combo. Nice Ooh, charge. Nice. Char and actually, I really like he was able to take out the minion horde and still hit the tower mm -hmm. too. A lot of good value there for the Flash. Yep. Yeah, Naders did a good push on the left side, but Prince is just too strong. Yeah. Prince, arrows, and minion horde is your defense. The, it's it's actually, the minion horde came down a little late because if minion hordes cast really early, it can kill the prince before it hits the tower. Mm. But if it comes down a little late between the deploy yes. time and the fact they have to attack and stuff. Yeah, and it might have been, uh, yeah. Yeah, it was probably a delay thing because he had enough elixir to do both of those. Right. So. All right, Hog Rider jumps across the river and it's going to get stopped by guards, but Poison's going to slow it down, earn it a swing. I, got, I wish I had a wizard card here. Wizard has been so far, I think, the MVP of what I've, of what I've seen, yeah. at least. It's been yeah. pretty good. Wizard has been sick. Unfortunately, we can't see the mirrored wizard. Oh, mirrored the wizard mirrored wizard crazy. was hot sauce. Yeah. I yeah. like that. That was Those good. Those bars just disappeared. Yeah. Yeah. Procol used prince and goblins. Did he? Uh, yeah, I remember he used goblins. Well, he's got spear. Uh, oh, yeah, he got goblins. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, that was a golem deck. The golem deck didn't have prints in well, it. At this, no, 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 no. I think Pro Cole used so many cards too as well. No, remember, as, like, remember, yeah, you can't count the one game that we discarded yeah. a Pro Cole. Yeah. So yeah. we'll take a look, but I think it's fine. Yeah, because we'll otherwise Pro Cole actually used all the cards. <laughs> like, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, <laughs> there's no way we could do this. Yeah, so. That was a good move, though. The Fireball and the Minion Horde, I like that move. So ha Flash having both Fireball and Arrows completely eliminates Nader's Minion Horde as like a mm -hmm. thing that you have yes. to be worried about. Yes, I mean, the Flash has so much Splash. He has... Minion, yeah, I mean, he has wizard, arrows, right. fireball. He has just everything in the world. It might just come down to a poison game. It could be. I could definitely yeah. see that. I mean, he's already got a good amount of damage on that oh, tower. Oh, God, do something. No, 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 no. It's oh, gonna, the oh. magic absorbs it, kills the goblins, and allows nice. the musketeer to finish that off. That was well positioned. All right, Hawk, this is a big point. Yep, fine. Two swings. One, two. Doink! Oh! And that's actually really good. That's Two really good for Fernaders, especially with the existence of poison, is like, yeah. yes. Oh, and the prince is gonna get the more. Princess, getting even just two chip shots on the tower is, oh, is pretty significant. Yeah, didn't quite make the second one. Poison on the prince and the wizard, and I think that's a good choice because the musketeer is gonna get right. gummed up by the guards. Valkyrie is buying time. Nice. Nice. That was a really good. I mean, that was yeah. only eight elixir to counter ten. Mm -hmm. Nine if you could the ice spirit, but you didn't need the ice spirit at all. Yep. Yep. Really, that Tesla tower is doing great for uh, for yeah. Flash. Oh, the goblins! Oh, no! Oh, the princess! No! Oh! The princess on that! And the oh! oh! I thought she was going to dodge the arrows, too. princess <laughs> nearly was, like, reenacting the Matrix right there. That was like, la last week we saw the Jason Bourne miner. This yeah. week we, should, we were going to see the Trinity princess. And here comes the wizard. Boink! Being a professional. Oh, the guards came out just a little too late to uh, yeah, distract to for the wizard. the wizard. Yeah, yeah. So that I think that's kind of the big thing that really hurts Wizard is just the five elixir cost. Just like that, yeah. you, you got you got minus one, you know. Right. Oh, oh no! Nader's got dunked! Oh no! No! And Flash pulls it off at the end there. That's why people don't use. You gotta be worried. You gotta be worried of those princes. Yep. Yeah. The Midian Horde was played and it had to catch up to the prince because it moved too fast, and then Nader's. In knowing that he needed to defeat the prince quickly enough, had to play the minions behind, but then got pre-arrowed. Yep. And the minion horde and the minions got taken out. I think Nader. I think he's fine because if I go back and look, the game that Pro Cole used Prince in, I think was. Oh, he did use Golem Prince. Did he do it in the second one too? And he took Prince out. Let's just go to a game three. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I think at this point Procol used so many cards. I think like, Procol might have, yeah, ended up using just, a whole bunch. So just we'll, make sure they're that happy. Flash, I'm happy. Everyone's happy. Like the only the Flash can only replace two cards. Yeah, just just that's that's Flash's deck. <laughs> All right, let's get into game three. 
Yeah, you're right, because I think between the confusion, this is fine. I, I, I'm comfortably happy with how different Flash's deck is. It's very, very different. I'm, yeah. I'm fine with it. Yeah, okay. All right. Oops. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. So the princess did really well out of Nader's side, and I'm glad to see Princess come out again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Nader's um, Nader's could definitely have swapped out for his subcards. I I don't know what his subcards were. I'm not really sure either. That wizard though has been ace. Oh, oh the ice attack jumped. The ice spirit still got the jump off, which is a bummer. Wow. Oh, yeah. the whole the the trifecta variant though. I mean, that's what we got here coming out. Uh, I definitely like that they were able to pick up all three of the same sort mm -hmm. of archetype. And let's see if this uh, Musketeer can come in and get some damage on the tower. It does lock on. Yeah. That's a pretty good win for, for Trifecta. Spirit Goblins are probably great in this format mm -hmm. because there's Zap. Like, if you can yeah. get Zap early, then you can just be like, boink, boink, boink. Yeah, Spirit Goblins are the kind of card, I mean, look, 300 damage for two Elixir and almost your opponent doesn't want to defend because it's so cheap. Yeah, you yeah. Know? yeah. It's, it's almost like every time you play Spear Goblins, you get 200. Absolutely, yeah. It's a great cycle card. Like it's it's also one of those things where it's there's a premium on cheap two and three cost cards. You have to play kind of more expensive variants. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, Procol. No, I feel <laughs> I feel bad because it's they not were your both, fault, Procol. I really appreciate that Procol and Flash were able to make it. We had some last minute, yeah. uh, you know, people who maybe couldn't yeah. make it, and so I just really appreciate they were able to do it. I am not going to make fun of them for not understanding my overly complicated rule yeah. set that I made. And really, I, it's just a fun event. It's well, the funny thing is that Rainy came up with an awesome clan format, and I came up with an awesome draft format, and then we just merged these ideas together, <laughs> and it might have ended up a little too complicated. So I think what we might end up doing is like Rainy's sweet clan format, and then my like yeah, then, solo draft, yeah. and then. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll play them individually. <laughs> individually. Yeah. But mm. I like it though. We're trying to figure out new formats. I'd right. love to have a clan. I'd love if we had three tournaments a week. Would you? Yeah. Hey, I, have a, I got a question for you guys. Would you guys watch four tournaments a week? Would you guys be interested in watching like four massive Super Magical Cup things a week? Is that something that yeah, you guys that's, would be interested in? Yeah, that's a good in? question. Ooh, Ooh, fireball! The fireball! Why did you not hit me? I think I think it was already off the finger, maybe I see, beforehand. I see. Oh, he slowed down, got the splash on the on the busted tier, anyways, yep. and now it's just a lone ice loser. Santa's dropping down the chimney. I figured out he got he he just yes. entered an abandoned house. Yeah. Like, there's nobody to give presents to. <laughs> what am I doing here? <laughs> God, Princess, though. Oh, I wish this... I mean, I feel bad because if Flash could have gotten that arrows out a little quicker, then the Spirit Goblins would have done a lot. Ooh, I think the Tesla actually took out the Ice Spirit. Oh, boy. And this is allowing a Prince to come ride back. If they're a little bit... Yes, 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 yes. No, too many. Yes, if they're a little bit earlier. Hmm. Okay, fair enough. We'll see. We'll see. Ooh, the nice pull, the Hog pull. Because Hog can definitely be fine with like two-thirds health, right? It's still a threat mm -hmm. to, to hit a tower. And it, it was able to save that Musketeer from getting shot. Prince comes back out. I feel like Flash's deck is so cheap and quick cycles. He's got yeah. t a lot of two and three cost cards that's mm -hmm. allowing him to like get back to his Prince over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. School and homework take a lot of time. I wouldn't want to recommend you do otherwise, but you could do otherwise. <laughs> All right, we'll see. <laughs> Super Magical Cup is once in a lifetime. Yep, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what do you think is the path to victory for... Uh, Flash here. Nader's is slowly chipping away with poisons and princesses and hogs. What what does Flash need to do to pull this game out? I think Flash just needs to find some way to get on top of the, the line of play. Right now he's just a second behind. He's yeah. reacting to what Nader's plays. He needs to be the one Ooh. playing things Ooh. against Nader. Oh, wow, that Ice Wizard has been amazing. That wow. Ice Wizard just fought the guards and all the other stuff. Yeah. And here comes the Poison Hog to ride by the Prince if at all possible. Oh, the Prince has slowed down too. One swing. That's probably going to be two. Two swings. Oh. Is that enough? I don't know if it's enough to go down on the own. He needs the, the Princess no, no, to get no, another no, no, shot. No, no, no. Or the, uh, I think he just needs to cycle at this he point. He needs to go, yeah. He, yeah. Well, Flash needs I think he's, to go I think he's now. fine. We got the Valkyrie to hold. All oh, those those no. good cycle troops are unfortunately not going to be great at getting through Valkyries and other sorts of stuff. So with the sort of drafted trifecta deck, Naders pulls it out in game three, and the Super yeah. Magicals will advance to fight Reddit Alpha, and let's get that yeah. going right away. Yep. So 